So, what's that noise? <gasps> Boys! Boys! Do you know what this means? It's our boy the whale! Hey, what is going on guys? It is Lachlan here and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Stranded Deep Survival Series. Now, if you guys did happen to miss the last episode, it was like the makeover episode slash the episode where we got the Ebola virus. This fish over here, adequately named the Ebola fish, which I do not want to touch at all. He, uh, he gave me a virus, as you can see. Wow, that is actually a grim sight to behold. Look at all of those little pimples on my uh, on my hand that's that's bannable so yeah hopefully in today's episode we're going to be hunting down a way for us to cure our disease of course like always if you are enjoying the series be sure to let me know with a like rating down below to make this virus thing go away we're going to need antibiotics and it's the only thing out of all the ships that i've rated this season is the only thing we do not have so we're going to have to man the fudge up today and do a lot of ship raid. I'm going to take the air tank with me for deep sea rides. I want to wait for the night time to try and hunt down those um, white caps on the waves to try and find those uh, those ships and other loots that we can take from these things. Anything else I want to take from here? I guess I'll take that bucket. And uh, No, there's a bucket. There's, I've got a bucket. Maybe no, that was my bucket. Wait a minute. Did I cook a bucket? No, it's, oh, well, that hurt. Are you kidding me? I'm already low on HP. I don't need that. See, so, yeah, we're losing health and we're also losing... Um, we're also losing uh, water, so we need to make sure we have plentiful amounts of water at all times. We have four servings here, and that's full. We just need some food. You guys won't believe it, but I finally found a coconut. Oh, there's another coconut on that tree as well. Oh, boys, we've hit the jackpot. Might even just do a little bit of fishing down there and try to find some other things. We might check the fish trap. People are saying I didn't bait it. Guys, I baited it with fish. Alrighty, so it appears that we are foraging into the night. I'm just going to go ahead and start cooking all of these beautiful potatoes and uh, make sure they are getting a nice little roast while we uh, have a look at maybe building a roof. Now, I don't want to do all this stuff because it is taking away from what we're meant to be doing, which is, of course, fixing up the uh, all of the other problems that we have in our uh, body right now. Alright, so let's go ahead and chuck this coconut down to make it drinkable and that should hopefully fill our it did yeah it did it did it did fill everything up and that's all done and cooked perfect so let's chop these up and eat these then eat as many potatoes as we need i'll take some fish with me i'll take a stack of fish for eating um oven lighter of course you know that goes down over here i'm not gonna bring the compass though i never use this compass at all it never gets used i, I never keep track i just know my round my way around the islands and that's hopefully going to keep me alive we can only hope all right let's set sail let's go because we are sailing into the night, we have to remember where we came from. So that is our island. I'm going to try and... I haven't explored much around here. So I'm going to look for some white caps and hopefully some loots. We need underwater ships. We need... Or, or, or above water ships. We just need ships, mainly. And that little medical pouch. It has to be antibiotics or we're going to have a bad time with this virus. I don't actually know if I've been to these islands yet. So we'll have a look and see. I probably have, but I just don't remember off the top of my head. Oh, here we go. Here's, oh, two persistent Y caps here. One there and one there. All right, there's a ship. Oh, God, you guys. Okay, this is an easy loot. Let's uh, man up for a second, guys. Where is the loot? Locate the loot. There it is right there. I don't think these guys have antibiotics. Oh, I thought I saw a shark coming towards me as soon as I dive in the water. And once again, phenomenal, phenomenal engineering. Oh, there's binoculars. Okay, good. Whew. We actually got it that time. All right, I just did that to get back up straight away. And then we'll probably sail over here. Actually, binoculars, I'll rate the binoculars because then I can actually see. There's another loot over here. We want... Oh, there's a ship over there as well. Perfect. I think I might have already been to it though. It looks like another basic loot. Like one of those toolboxes I just opened up. I don't know if uh, medicine can be held in one of those though. That's the thing. Yeah, it's one of the exact same things I just went through. Right, I'm just going to reverse and then go into it and have a look and see what we're dealing with here. There it is right there. All right, little scout and nothing. Phenomenal. Now, the thing I hate about this boat is that it's half underwater and uh, half on the water. So, we're going to find out to see if I've actually been in it before. All right. So, let's get right close to the ship. Cut the motors. And let's get a little bit closer with the sail. All right. So, the, the case is closed. If there's items in there, that means this is a fresh boat and we're in the money. All right. So, let's go ahead here. And I uh, could have been here. Could have very well been here. Hmm, let's check in here, please. I beg. I actually beg. Oh, I've totally been here. Yeah, I've totally been here. But was this one of the ones that I manned up? Or was this one of the ones where I bitched out? That's the real question. Alright, guys. 
I think this is one where I manned up. But did I miss anything in here? Locker, locker. Nah. This has all been explored. Alright. Let's get the forge doodles out of here. Alright. This is an already explored place. There's nothing else for us in here. Oh. I missed this completely. It's a ship that looks like it's half underwater. It's what we need, but it's a scary what we need. And now it's raining as well. Alright, and the sun is actually starting to come up a little bit as well. Oh, this is a spooky one, alright. This is a spooky one. Let's have a look and see what we're dealing with here. Alright, so this is like that other one that I had with the barrels. There could also potentially be more barrels here. I love how it just goes foggy as well. That's just great. Alright, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to put my boat on top of this thing while I can. When, this, when the tide comes in, I'm going to put it on top. Just because it's safe then. Uh, see, so look, right now the tide's going to come in and there we go. Alright, we're safe here. We're safe. We're safe. We're safe. I just vision is at an all-time low, and I can't see where anything is. I'm a little scared, to say the least. All right, I think I'm going to go through there and find things. Ugh, it looks... I don't know if sharks can get to here, though. That's the thing. Oh, look, the sun's rising. What the... F I just scared the living days out of me. All right. I don't know if something just knocked us off, or if it was just a little weird thing, or what. I got knocked off completely, and it scared me. Wow, you still can't see crap with the fog. Ugh, that's so annoying. Waves are getting extra choppy right now. Alright, here we go. Let's see, where's the chest? I gotta avoid that because I think that's some bad stuff. Alright, let's have a look here. What are we dealing with? Toolbox? Label maker. Alright, we already have one of those. Alright, that's fine. So, label maker. We already have a lot of those, but there is more on this ship. Yeah, that's a misclick. I don't like getting in the water when I'm not meant to be in the water. We have an issue here. We have to man up. I don't really know what's down there. But I wanted a ship and I said I'd, if I found the ship, I'd explore it. So, let's, uh, let's do it. I'm going to get my ship back here, though. I believe that the entrance to the back of it's just there. So, we have to dive, we have to dive quite deep. This uh, may require the bottle of air. All right, here we go. Big death. Big death. Big breath. Here we go. This is us. What do we got? No, that's not what we want. Flare, bucket, seawater, console, fuel tank. Where's the where's the meds? Alright, I just drank a, a, Oh, wait, 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 wait. Locker. Oh my god, just a bunch of crap. Alright, we have to get out. And I just expended the last of my stuff. We got everything that we needed. Okay. Oh, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm pretty sure we got everything in there. Oh, we used our tube of air. And, of course, the grain, the rain, it goes away. Yeah, the grain, the rain. It's gone, and uh, so is our dreams. And we need to eat. All right, let's go to the island and set up shop for a little bit and throw away what we need and don't need. Man, that is seriously unbelievable. No medical things there at all. So let's have a look here. Flares, they really are just bants. We really don't need this engine fuel tank. I, I'm just sick of it. I don't even know where that went. There, it went backwards. Um, <laughs> there's a lot of resources on this island. I can see lots of driftwood stacks and corrugated scraps. Uh, a toolbox thing there as well. Nothing major for me. I'm going to go ahead and eat the last of these cooked pilchards, but we're going to need some water as well. So let's go ahead and drink that. Oh, it's another ship over here. Perfect. All right, so let's try and find a little thing to eat if we can. Um, a coconut would be perfect. Uh, oh, they have answered my prayers with a coconut. And hopefully there is anti... But uh Uh-oh. Okay, I didn't need that. I really, oh, I really didn't need that. Uh, hopefully there are some antibiotics, just in case. I'm going to say I'm getting like dangerously low here. Uh, dangerously low. This is a very high tree. This is a very high tree. It's very high. I don't, I don't like if I, I don't like, I don't like the, the high trees. The trees are too high for me. Whoa, where'd this machete come from? I've been here before. This is where I, I I've already explored that, but did I go underneath it? That's the question. Ah, <laughs> all right. Let's, uh, let's collect some of these corrugated scraps, I guess, for now. Let's just do a quick lap around the island. But yeah, I think I've been there and I dropped my machete. Is there other island, other things I may have dropped here? I can't believe I found my stuff. Oh, I thought it was lashings. Yeah, no, I've definitely been here before. What is a machete even good for? Because as far as I know, the axe does everything better. A uh, strong tool for good cutting, a good durability, useful for chopping trees. But then what is this good for? Um, good durability, useful for chopping trees. What is the difference between a machete? Does a machete do more damage or what? Am I missing something? It's kind of uh, confusing. All right, let's eat this up 
And uh, I'm going to leave this engine tank here for now because I don't need it. Alrighty, there we go. Full belly and ready to roll out. Um, we'll double check this place over here just to see if I maybe was a little bit of a girl pants with it and didn't uh, get all of it, but uh, we'll see. Wow, today I learned you can't eat and ride at the same time. Alrighty, so we have a full stomach ready to go. We're going to go ahead and explore the other side of uh, this island, that boat thing. See if that's got any uh, resources at all. And uh, just double check it in case we didn't explore all of it. But I think I did because uh, I had that machete over there. There's no way I've missed this place. There's absolutely no way. Is that something on top of it right there? Yeah, this... Okay, did we go underneath it? That's the real question though. Because if we have it, and it's on an angle, so it's kind of easier to do and get inside. Um, still scary, but easier. All right, let's go ahead and explore. Here we go. Make sure to not get any other... Oh, there's a sea urchin. I see it. I see the sea urchin. Uh, okay, go around this way. And we've already been inside, but just double checking that we got everything. And of course we did because we were just on the series, but we missed something. All right, at least there's no sharks though. At least there's no sharks. So there's no island in the distance here. Uh, we're just uh, running on fumes right now to try to find anything we can that will work. Alrighty, well we have successfully found the end of the map. That's what the boys represent. And uh, successfully found nothing on our way. But we've made ourselves so far out of the map that... Uh, I think we deserve a medal because there's literally nothing for ages. That's the island we just came off. And then we're gonna try and circle around and hit that island, but we need to hit ships in between. But we, it's not nighttime either, so it's hard to find ships. So, what's that noise? <gasps> Boys! Boys! Do you know what this means? It's our boy the whale! I haven't seen him in ages! Mate, how you going? How are you going, mate? Oh, I haven't seen you in all, all season, really. Dude, how are you going? Let's turn this motor off. I want to ride the whale. Look at me. I'm riding the whale. Hold back. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Scared, scared, scared. Let me get back on the... Wait, what are the sharks eating me? Okay, good, 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 good. All right, now you can't kill or eat this guy, and he really doesn't do anything as far as I know. Um, he, You can ride him, though. Oh, wait, no, my, my ship. My ship. No. Oh, look at that. He makes a big noise, <laughs> but he makes such a big noise. You know where he's at. Okay, so unfortunately for us, our boy the humpback whale doesn't actually do anything. He's just so friggin' epic. That's all he really is. Um, but I want to get a good view at him from underneath. I haven't really had an underneath shot of him yet. So let's have a look at our boy and just say hi to him from underneath. Hello, Mr. Humpback Whale. Oh, okay. Well, okay. He doesn't like it when I look at him. He's just like, get the fudge on or get the fudge out. Looks like... He does go down in the water and then um, resurface and come back down and whatnot. But normally when I find a whale, I normally get distracted with him for a good 20 minutes. And then, yeah. Actually, you know what, buddy? Could you transport an item for me? I'm really looking at this machete you see here. And uh, I'm not sure what to do with it. So you can have it. It's your machete. It really is your machete. I want to see how... Oh, the ship! The ship! Ah! No. Okay, we got to be careful because this is a deep sea biome and deep sea biomes also have a very good chance of spawning um bad things like great white sharks look at that he's carrying the machete he will be forever known as the humpback machete he just carries the machete wherever he goes anyways mr humpback whales we have things to do are you gonna leave the map you look like you're on a direction to leave the map you can't do that to us buddy well i think the humpback whale wants to leave the series and the map itself um but yeah, funnily enough, I was looking it up. Humpback whales used to be a 20% spawn chance in deep sea motion, uh, deep sea biome. Sorry, now they're only 6%. So he's kind of a rare spawn. But unfortunately, he is uh, one. Oh, did you still lose machete? Did you lose your machete, mate? That I just gave you. Better not have. Better not have. Looks like he's lost it. Oh, he changed direction. He realized he hit the world border. He was like, oh, whoops. So yeah, have fun and uh, see you next time, Mr. Whale. Goodbye. Oh, looks like we've got some other people in the sea as well. Too bad they're too slow for me. Alrighty, and we've officially completed our full circle, but we got to find a whale, so I can't even be mad. Okay, guys, that is all we have time for for today's Stranded Deep episode. I'm going to start the next episode on this island over there. So hopefully you guys did go on to enjoy this episode. We found ourselves a whale, man. I'm actually really excited. We did, in fact, not find anything to save us, though. We are still dying and losing health, and I think if we don't get to this island soon enough, we could actually die. So, fingers crossed for that one. 
And uh, yeah, I hope you guys still go on to enjoy the series. If so you do enjoy this kind of content and aren't subscribed to the channel, be sure to hit that like rating and subscription button down below. And I'll catch you guys next time for another brand new episode. Later, guys.